Hello, this is my book report on Captain Underpants, and the title of the book is Captain Underpants and the Preposterous Plight of the Purple Potty People. And yes, you heard it correctly, so I'll say it again, Captain Underpants and the Preposterous Plight of the Purple Potty People. And the author is Dav Pilkey. Some of Dav Pilkey's previous work is Cat Kong, Dragon's Fat Cat, and Dog Breath. The copyright date year is 2006, and the genre is FICTION! around now in a parallel universe in the year 2012. For example, all the teachers, like Mrs. Shipka, for example, would be really mean in the real universe. But in the other universe, they'd be really nice. And, well, here's a picture of them in the time machine using it two years in a row. The main characters are Mr. Crop, a mean, fat, selfish man that whenever you snap your fingers, he turns into Captain Underpants, and whenever you put water on his head, he turns back into mean old Mr. Crop. Captain Underpants is a nice fat man who only wears underpants and fights against evil. And then there's George, is a nice but naughty boy that is Captain Underpants' companion and that also fights against evil with him. And there's Harold, another nice but naughty boy, and that is George's best friend, and, well, Captain, also Captain Underpants' companion. The whole story is about George and Harold going to save their pets, Sulu, a bionic hamster, and Cracker, a pterodactyl. The evil doubles try and hypnotise them, but Cracker can't get hypnotised, so he goes and helps his friends. But Sulu does, and he becomes evil. So Captain Underpants comes to the aid of his friends to try and save Sulu. And I won't tell you what's at the end of the story, you have to read it yourself. I think people should read this book because it makes you laugh. And also, well, throughout the book, Harold keeps on things, things like, at least nothing bad could happen now. So, of course, something actually does. Well, and I also think it really makes you laugh, so it also has really funny pictures, and it's easy to read. And I hope you have fun reading it, if you are going to read it. Bye!